right, this is exciting. I'm here in Blakely's barn with Micah, who's a Nigerian dwarf goat, mm -hmm. and my friend Eunice Fram. You might have seen her. She's the one who runs the Blakely's Barnyard Bonanza at the Children's Zoo, which is a total blast for young kids. Now, you might wonder, why is Thane holding this big white card? Well, it's not a card. It's a fancy painting canvas. And that's because Micah is not just an average goat. As you can see, she's trained to stand on this little box. She's a star of the show. And we've got some paint. Look at this. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. So uh, she clearly likes red. That's looking good. <laughs> That is wild. Don't worry, this is toxin-free paint. Here's some more red. There you go, yeah. yeah this is great. At the zoo, we have a number of animals that paint. You might have seen paintings that have been done by our elephants. Even somewhere cats will walk through the paint. And rhinos will use their lips and their nose. But to actually hold a brush like this in its mouth, you gotta admit, this is a very, very artistic and talented Goat. <laughs> Goats are interesting animals. You know, they're very smart animals, and they make for a really good show, of course, here at the zoo. And now, mm -hmm. of course, they make for good painting. If you're wondering, we do sell some of our animal-created art in our gift shop. So you can check that out. It's perfect for the holiday season. And also, at times, there are opportunities. You can look on our website where you or your family could come to the zoo, go behind the scenes, and do something like this. With Micah, here's a little blue. Looking good, sweetie. Yeah, she's got a look. She's got a look. Good job, Micah. <laughs> now, this is amazing. What steps do you go through to get Micah to be a painter? So the first thing we had to do was teach Micah how to hold a paintbrush. So we started to work on that. So I never used paint in the beginning just because I knew originally when she was holding that paintbrush, she um, was probably going to turn it or twist it or throw it back out. So I taught her how to hold that brush and the direction to hold that brush. And then as soon as she learned how to hold the paintbrush, I then taught her how to hold the paintbrush and touch the canvas. So as you can see, she knows hold the paintbrush, and then I touch the canvas, perfect. And then I taught her, okay, now you know how to do that. Now we're gonna work on you actually painting on the canvas. So that was the next thing that we started working on, which she is a lady who likes to do quick, fast strokes, unlike her brother who likes to do slow, controlled strokes. <laughs> I think it's fantastic. You know, this is a thing that's fun to see and see her doing this behavior. Certainly visitors could see it or get it. But the other neat side to it, Eunice, is all around the zoo, what we do with animal enrichment, giving animals different things to do on different days. Exactly. And help stimulate them. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, this is toxin-free paint. I say that just because she's got all over <laughs> her snoot. But she sure uh, does. She'll certainly be fine. Well, this is fun. Thanks for doing this. Yep. Here we are down at Blakely's Barn at the Cincinnati Zoo Children's Zoo with Micah, the Nigerian dwarf goat, Eunice Fram, and my new famous painting, <laughs> Christmas is Coming, so you've actually helped me a lot. Good job, Micah.